Hey guys, you know how I always start my vlogs when I'm with like the same group of people the same way every time? Yeah, I'm still with them and we haven't left each other since, so let's just do this one more time. Get it! Yeah! and we've been hanging out with it. It's so fun. Isn't she so cute? Her name's Piper. It's just called Stickfish. <laughs> it's like a few days after VidCon and we're still together. We're all at Jake's apartment now and we have a Stickfish with us. We're gonna go out and have some fun today and go to like Santa Monica Pier and like flirt with cute boys and take our tops off. And, yes! Know, I don't really know what the fuck this vlog's gonna turn into, like always, but um, let's go to Santa Monica. Hey guys, before we get into the rest of the video, I just want to say thank you to Honey for sponsoring today's video. Guys, I am so excited about this because I genuinely have been using Honey for so long because all my favorite YouTubers always recommend it to me. You guys know that I can be a little bit cheap sometimes and I am one who loves to save money because who doesn't? Honey is a free tool that you download to your computer's browser and while you're shopping online in any website, Honey scans the internet for coupon codes and other discounts and then automatically applies the coupon with the biggest savings to your cart at checkout. It works on over 20,000 websites websites like Ulta, Sephora, Etsy, Forever 21, PacSun, Nasty Gal, Morphe, even Groupon. It takes zero effort to install and with just two clicks you can start saving anytime you shop online. I actually used Honey the other day when I was checking out on Morphe which is amazing because guys let's face it makeup is so overpriced so anytime you can get a nice little coupon on that stuff it goes a long way. There's really no reason to not start using Honey today. It's free to use and easy to install on your computer in just two clicks. Get Honey for free at joinhoney.com slash Caitlin Ray and thanks again to Honey for sponsoring this video. Let's get into the rest of the video now. The little stick fish keeps trying to eat all the cat, cat litter in the bathroom. Wait, I didn't even know you had a cat in your apartment. We did, but then we just like told her to go home. <laughs> you just told the cat to leave. <laughs> you showed it to the door. Your rent is due. You're yeah. right, right. You can't tell me that this dog doesn't look like a stick fish. It's like, I'm a YouTuber. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't understand people who throw out like their passes and stuff Wait. for things. I have like a whole collection box at my house. I want one. Why? One, two, three. That's so sentimental. You literally finesse Bitcoin. You want to throw away the most. But like precious. those things, like 20 years from now, you're gonna be like, what do I do with these things? But I have a whole box. Like it's so like it's, it's memories. Like, she have a whole box 20 years later. You're yes, like, it's memories. I just don't get it. You're gonna try to buy mine off me in like 20 years. <laughs> Imagine it's like people are selling them at like shops for like a hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> Coachella bands. <laughs> yeah, they throw out their Coachella bands too. Like, why would you do that? I'm sorry. Meg thinks stickfish is ugly. It's yeah. so ugly. No, it is not. so cute. I, I, I literally just sleeping. said that on camera. Dude, it's so <laughs> I much was sleeping last night. I haven't even seen the dog yet. I got in really late, and I'm sleeping, and all of a sudden I hear ever go, oh. <laughs> Stickfish is on me! <laughs> and this little rat was looking at me. It's a stickfish! <laughs> Don't be mean to my dog! I have to like Sorry, you're ugly. <laughs> oh my God. She looks sad. You made fun of her. Yeah, good job, Meg. Now the dog's fucking sad. She isn't the only one. <laughs> <laughs> so, as many of you might know, I put a hole in the wall because I was drunk and I was just trying to climb up and have a good time. At the Airbnb for yeah, VidCon. Yeah. And I told my dad about it like jokingly and he just messaged me like five minutes ago saying, also, how would you like me to bang your car with a hammer where you get off destroying other people's property? Is that the way I raised you, really? <laughs> Like, it was an accident. <laughs> you also fixed it. You plastered know, I, the whole I, wall. And like speckled the wall and painted it. I went all out. Speckled? You yeah, he speckled I it. Speckled the shit out of that wall. <laughs> You guys really won't go on the roller coaster with us? I get so sick on the roller coaster. Bro! It's like five seconds long. It's flat. I'm scared of the roller coaster. It doesn't, even, <laughs> it doesn't even have a drop. It goes around enough. Yeah, and it's big. I just want her to go on some drop off. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everyone, I've been left alone. All my friends have left me. I have no more friends. My friends hate me. I don't know what I'm doing with my life anymore. <laughs> she just saw me filming on her camera. And if you don't keep this in the video, you motherfucker, you're canceled. I can't stop eating various forms of bread and cheese. I'm wondering why my skin is breaking out so bad, but here's the root of all evil. I'm gonna just make my problems worse. Fuck it. I got my eyes on you. Wait, 
Wait, the cards are so cute. They're Stranger are you Things. Save this too? I actually <laughs> probably <laughs> will. <laughs> You're gonna be so jealous of all my little collectives one day. I'm like, oh my god, remember that? Yeah, and I'm gonna remember it because I'll still have it. Maybe I start saving them. You should. I got a trend with you. You need to have a memory box. <laughs> okay, I'll do it. <laughs> Fuck. Did you get first roller coaster? Yeah. That's lame, Nick. This is such a fun date spot. Good thing I have no one to go on a date with. We're going on a date. <laughs> if Meg oh, loves it, I'm going to be so happy. Yo, the Friday. angle that I'm holding my camera is sick. And I hope there's an earthquake while we're on the roller coaster. We're gonna get back and be like, one more time! And then gonna be like, what? <laughs> Nick is so terrified to go on this fucking roller coaster. Yo, how scary is this? Oh my god, no! We're on a roller coaster. <laughs> Them again. What no, are they? You won't buy them. <laughs> no, somebody, a company sent me them. Oh, okay. <laughs> Yo, Meg, on me, on me. <laughs> it's the least I can do. <laughs> It is 12.30. I am the only one in Jake's apartment right now. We got woken up at 8 in the morning by protesters outside of the apartment. That was fun. I love hearing people screaming at the uh, Crocodon. That's super fun. That was enjoyable. I definitely did not vlog anything after Cheesecake Factory last night. Meg and I went to go hang out with a friend that we made at VidCon last weekend last night. Didn't vlog any of that. And then we got home super late and then just slept in this morning basically I don't know what the hell we're gonna do today I honestly think that it's just gonna be a chill editing day because I need to fucking get my life together I've just been non-stop going at it and traveling and just having so much going on the past two weeks so now today is my day to snuggle with Piper and edit I am a tired and getting sick girl Piper where are you going <laughs> um okay If Piper leaves, then I leave. I'll talk to you later. I'm not showing my face because I simply look ridiculous right now, but this is where we have been posted up the past five hours. The rooftop of Jake's apartment is so beautiful. It comes with this free view of a fucking whack job filming TikToks. This place is so big. It is. Like, um, I just said you were gonna so see me, nice but here I am. I feel so sick. Yeah. So I've just been like laying in bed all day. Like, it's six o'clock and we're now just like. Mm -hmm. Meg definitely doesn't sound too hot right now. Now. 
but rightfully so. It's been a fucking crazy past two weeks, and especially just the past week of VidCon. Like, who knows what germs <laughs> we were around. I know, we literally, it's like, disgusting like, to think about. And I just like don't even want to fly because I know like it makes it so much worse. Yeah, dude. Like, Hopefully your eardrum doesn't rupture because every time I fly when I'm sick, my eardrum ruptures. <laughs> <laughs> like not really. <laughs> okay, show me your TikTok, Nick. <laughs> Dope. Sweet, I'll be blocking your number <laughs> after you leave tomorrow. <laughs> There's also another part to this. There's a whole other balcony on the other side. Guys, it's just so fucking pretty. I seriously like wish I could just work here and edit videos and film every single day of my life. Views like this literally make me just want to fucking move to LA right now. Can you guys please? I have no problem just messing my flight. Cancel it, you fucking whore! I love you! <laughs> I'm so sad. They've grown up They've so They've grown fast. up so much. They're going to college. <laughs> Meg and Nick just left, and I'm fucking sad as fuck already. But I just got an acai bowl, and my friend Tate works for this pool floaty company, and they're doing like a fun little retreat to the beach today. So I get to go see Gabby and Anna and everybody, and I haven't seen them all since I was in Hawaii with them back in May. So I'm gonna go do that now. We'll vlog the whole thing. But yeah, glad I'm doing something to um, be distracted from the fact that all my friends just left, and I'm really fucking sad. But yeah, my Uber's outside. I need to go, so let's go. Look who I am Hi. with right now. I haven't seen Jack any of this food since Hawaii. I, I know. know. Tate's up there. I've seen you so many times. <laughs> I can't get away from you. We <laughs> party together. I'm a mom. I can't party. I know. She's got her little dude. I miss you so much, guys. We're going to have so much fun today. We're at Malibu Seafood right now. Big seafood fans here. I know. We come to a seafood restaurant to all order chicken strips. <laughs> So nobody informed us that it was a uh, mile walk to this. I am burning up in the sun right now. I'm using my towel to cover my shoulders because I haven't put on sunscreen yet. How are we feeling about the walk, guys? Honestly, I'm, it's invigorating. So we're working off the food we just ate, so I'm what? not mad about it. <laughs> We have a stalker. <laughs> We're slowly but surely joining you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Gabby! Don't make me get up there and push you. <laughs> Gabby! It is two o'clock right now, you guys. I just got my nails done. I got neon yellow. I'm really fucking pumped about that. My nails were looking ratchet as fuck. Right now, I am like not even getting ready. I'm ready to go to like my first like meeting as a YouTuber. I feel so weird just saying this because I feel like every other YouTuber on planet Earth is always like vlogging in LA and is like, I'm going to a secret meeting today and I can't tell you anything about it, but you guys will know soon. And like, that's kind of the vibe that I have going on right now. But like, I also don't know if you'll know anything soon because I don't know, like, I honestly don't know what this meeting is for exactly. I'm going to Universal Music Group for a fucking meeting right now, which is insane to say out loud. Like, you guys know how much I love music and concerts and everything under the sun revolving music. And the fact that I have been invited to Universal Music Group fucking headquarters in Santa Monica for a meeting is fucking whack. I can't believe I'm saying that out loud right now. Once again, I'm not entirely sure what the meeting is about. I have like a general idea. I don't even know. I just hope that like this works out and that like the things that I'm imagining in my mind as an outcome of this are actually the outcome. You always see so many YouTubers going to like meetings and everything that like would be cool to have meetings for, but like a meeting with Universal is so specific to my brand and everything that like it just makes it like 10 times more exciting to like be having a meeting there. Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. My meeting is in an 
hour. I have to take like a 25 minute Uber there. I'll show you guys my outfit right now. I need to put on my boots. The lighting's like kind of bad, but this is my outfit today. I just borrowed one of Jake's roommate's dresses because I literally did not have anything to wear to this. So this is so cute. So obsessed with this dress. And then I'm just wearing my usual black booties. Gonna go now. I need to go get Nasa Evil so badly. I'm starving. And we're gonna go to Santa Monica and go to this meeting. I'm gonna fucking lose my mind. Hey, okay, it's the next day. I didn't end up vlogging anymore after the meeting yesterday, but guys, oh, hello, stickfish. Like, why do you have to do this right now? Can I film, please? The meeting went so well. Obviously, the title is clickbait. Like, hello, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Can you stop biting me? I can't fucking sing for shit. We all know this. I'm not actually, like, signed to them. Just because of, like, my YouTube channel and because of all the support that you guys have shown me the past year and everything, like, I get to start working with them on some really cool things that can you stop? Piper, stop! I just get to start working with Universal on some really cool things, like, eventually, and I don't know, I just want to say thank you to you guys, because this would not be a thing without you guys. I just, like, am so mind-blown over the fact that that whole thing was a thing. I don't know. I'll have more details and everything in the future. I can't say that much right now, because I don't really have that much to share. It was so cool getting a tour of the Universal office and everything. You know, if I wasn't doing YouTube and I had, like, a real job, that's where I would want to work. I've always wanted to, like, dip my toes in the music industry in some way, shape, or form, but it's so cool that I get to do my job on YouTube and then also kind of work with the job that, like, I would have wanted if I went to college and all that shit and, like, worked in, like, an office atmosphere. It's just, like, both my worlds are, like, collided kind of I guess like they're collabing that was cheesy I'm sorry this is everything and more that like 12 year old and 13 year old me wanted all my dreams are like coming true like I know that's so cheesy but it's the truth and Piper I'm gonna freaking give you so much love and attention and affection because I love you but you're kind of obnoxious sometimes Love you. They gave me this sweatshirt. I guess Jaden Smith wore this. Stop! <laughs> I guess he did Jimmy Kimmel the other day and wore this sweatshirt. It's not even released yet. Fucking hello! I'm so cool, kind of. They also gave me this visor. It's like so cute. It's red and says Universal on the side. I honestly want to take an Instagram picture in this, so I'm going to try to do that at some point. But yeah, just wanted to say thank you to everyone at Universal that gave me the tour. You know who you are. And Piper, please stop biting me. I had so much fun and I'm so grateful that I got to do that and I hope that I can come back soon and I hope that Piper just stops biting me. Ah, I'm excited for the future I guess. I feel like every YouTuber has to say that after they went to a meeting. That's all the time I have for today. I need to go take Piper for a walk or something because this is getting ridiculous. Thank you so much for watching. Maybe one day I will actually get signed to a music label. Hopefully not because if a music label ever actually signs me then they all must be deaf because I can't sing for shit and oh my god you're obnoxious. Alright make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media is down below my summer merch is out by the way so go check that out and i will see you guys in my next video i love you peace out piper <laughs>